Are you the first or second funniest in the family? First. Not a chance. <laughs> first right here. All right. <laughs> do your best impression of me, and, it, and we both have to do it. My best impression of you? Yes. Um. It's going to be hilarious. Hmm. I'm just trying to think of the best one. Because there's a lot of Orin impressions. <laughs> I'm lost. I don't know. I don't want you to get your feelings hurt. Would you get your feelings hurt if I did an impression of you? No. You sure? Yes. Okay. <laughs> hey, Dad. <laughs> I know you're working, but hey, Dad. <laughs> hey, Dad. <laughs> hey, Dad. <laughs> Look at this great game. <laughs> Is that you? Accurate. Okay. All right. Is that spot on? My, now I do impression. What's your impression of you? No. Yeah, Are I you doing it of me? Yeah. Are you sure? Okay, yeah. go ahead. Work, 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 oh, work. Oh, okay, work. so the total opposite. <laughs> I'm always working and you're always bothering? Yep. Okay, good. <laughs> At least we're on the same page on that one. What's something you think we should do more of? I mean, it's probably obvious. See your answers, buddy. More time to get there because you're always working. Oh yeah. Yeah. Do you do you think that mom being able to stay at home all the time with you and have time with at least one parent is nice, or would you just want more time with me? Honestly, it's kind of both. I like spending time with mom, and I wish I could spend more time with you. Cool. What's something you've learned as a father that you knew as a child? That I knew or didn't know as a child? It's just, it's a, oh, that you wish you knew as a child. Just how much responsibility another tiny person is and what they become. Because there's so much to being a parent. So what we tell your sisters, like, think really long and hard before you decide to be an adult. Because, you know, we, I became a dad at 20, right? I was still a kid, having a kid. So what I know now is how much work and love and effort that goes into being a parent. And I tell other people, like my 10-year-old son, Enjoy being a kid. Don't try to grow up too fast because adulting is difficult. What are you most excited for in the new year? Everything going <laughs> away and, and <laughs> COVID going away and that I can get outside without get wearing a mask and it's not gonna, and it's gonna be better for school. But you don't like outside. No, I just, I like, I don't like, see, I don't like bugs and like, I'm fine with the outside, just not with forests and- And bugs. And like wild environments. What's the hardest thing about being my dad that I may not realize? Ooh, that's a really good question. The hardest thing about being your dad is always worrying about how kids treat you at school all the time, every day. Because I am an adult and it is against the law to harm children. But when they're mean to you, or they bully you, or they're not nice to you, that makes me very angry, very upset. Because I want everybody to see you like I see you, right? like an awesome, smart, intelligent, funny, you know, little boy that you are, that's growing into a young man. Like you got your little blazer on here, but it's hard when you can't control other people. So that's what I get upset about.
or worry about. So if you could change anything or improve anything about our family, what would it be? It could be adding something to. Uh, hmm. There's not much wrong with the family. Well, that's so, good. Uh, why people not on their phones as much? Hmm. Because I just want to hang out with the family most of the time. No, just so we're clear. That includes you, right? Yeah, because you're on your phone a lot. <coughs> But I just check notifications or just do something because I'm bored and no, and I just want to hang out, but no one wants to hang out with me, so I'm just mm. playing a game. I hang out with you. Most of the time you're on work. Oh, well, if I'm not working. But then again, you're on your phone on Facebook or something. Oh. Like mom is. That's good for me to hear. Thank you. When you think about the first time we met, what do you remember feeling? What was it? When you think about the first time we met? Yeah, so when I was born, basically. Oh, exactly, when you were born. Joy, excitement, and fear. Why fear? Because you were very early. You were premature and your lungs weren't working properly, so you had to go to the NICU. What have you learned from me that changed you? Mm, that was when you were diagnosed with autism, when you were four. I learned that your brain and your personality and the way you do things is very different and unique. Um, especially from me, but it taught me a lot about perspective and how I look at things and how I parent and just things I need to be more patient with and cognizant of, so you help me with that. What makes us family? You're super literal, so I have a feeling I know where this one's going. <laughs> Love. Love? Wow. You surprised me with that answer. How? Because usually you're very literal and say, because you're my dad. Why do you love me? Should I be super literal on this one? You can if you <laughs> want to. <laughs> because you are the greatest kiddo. I'm not going to say greatest kiddo because your sisters will get upset. You're the greatest little boy on this planet. You have so many great attributes. You're smart. You're funny. You have great manners. You're, you, you love everyone with your whole heart. You love hard, right? So everyone know, everybody knows where they're at with you. You love cash, so you treat everyone in our family all the way down to our fur kid. You treat him with a lot of love and just play with him all the time. So you just, you're a great kid. I love everything about you. Hey, it's Ashika here from The Skin Deep. We really appreciate you being here and watching this conversation. If you love what we're doing and want to stay in the loop, sign up to our newsletter for special deals, new conversations, and to be a part of our community. Sign up at theskindeep.com slash subscribe. Thank you.